published 1252 est, the 23rd of November, the 2017 updated 1307 est, the 23rd of November, 2017. Tesla has begun accepting pre-orders for its electric truck and revealed it will cost buyers at least $150,000, with production set to begin in 2019. For those who want a truck in a hurry, a special Founders Series is being made, with $200,000 required up front to get one of the first 1,000 made. Chief Executive Elon Musk unveiled the big rig, dubbed the Tesla Semi, by riding the truck into an airport hangar near Los Angeles last week in front of an invited crowd of what Tesla said were potential truck buyers and Tesla car owners. Scroll down for video Tesla has begun accepting pre-orders for its electric truck and revealed it will cost buyers at least $150,000 and $50.00 oh, oh, extra overall. The Semi is more responsive, covers more miles than a diesel truck in the same amount of time, and more safely integrates with passengers car traffic, Tesla said. Without a trailer, the Tesla Semi achieves 060 mph in 5 seconds, compared to 15 seconds in a comparable diesel truck. It does 060 mph in 20 seconds with the full 80,000-pound load, a task that takes a diesel truck about a minute. Tesla's price list for the truck has been revealed and you can pre-order one today most notably for truck drivers and other travelers on the road. It climbs 5% grades at a steady 65 miles per hour, whereas a diesel truck maxes out at 45 miles per hour on a 5% grade. Musk has described electric trucks as Tesla's next effort to move the economy away from fossil fuels through projects including electric cars, solar roofs and power storage. However, some analysts fear the truck will be an expensive distraction for Tesla, which is burning cash, has never posted an annual profit, and is in self-described manufacturing hell starting up production of the $35,000 Model 3 sedan. Tesla also has to convince the trucking community that it can build an affordable electric big rig with a range and cargo capacity to compete with relatively low-cost, time-tested diesel trucks. The heavy batteries eat into the weight of cargo an electric truck can haul. The truck can go up to 500 miles at maximum weight at highway speed, Musk said. Diesel trucks are capable of traveling up to 1,000 miles on a single tank of fuel. Musk took to the stage to introduce the highly anticipated Tesla Semi on Thursday. Musk has described electric trucks pictured as Tesla's next effort to move the economy away from fossil fuels through projects including electric cars, solar roofs and power storage. The Tesla Semi can also go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5 seconds without cargo or reach 60 miles per hour in 20 seconds at the maximum weight allowed on U.S. highways of 80,000 pounds. I can drive this thing and I have no idea how to drive a semi, Musk joked. Entry-level diesel trucks star at around $100,000, and says there will be cost saving of over $200,000 over the life of the truck, based on fuel consumption and electricity versus diesel costs. Ahead of the unveiling, Tesla executives showed off the Class 8 truck to journalists, describing it as trailer agnostic, or capable of hauling any type of freight. Class 8 is the heaviest weight classification on trucks. The truck has four motors, one for each rear wheel. Tesla designed the cab with a roomy feel and a center seat for better visibility. Executives said two touch screens pictured inside the cab flank the driver day cab which is not a sleeper has a less prominent nose than on a classic truck, and the battery is built into the chassis. It has four motors, one for each rear wheel. Tesla designed the cab with a roomy feel and a center seat for better visibility, executives said. Two touch screens flank the driver. The truck has Tesla's latest semi-autonomous driving system, designed to keep a vehicle in its lane without drifting, change lanes on command, and transition from one freeway to another with no human intervention. Reuters reported in August that Tesla was discussing self-driving trucks with regulators in Nevada and California, but the company did not mention full autonomy in a release on the new vehicle. Old Dominion Freight Line Inc., the fourth largest U.S. less-than-truckload carrier, which consolidates smaller freight loads onto a single truck, said it would not use the Tesla truck. The Tesla Semi has four motors, one for each rear wheel. I can drive this thing and I have no idea how to drive a Semi, Musk joked during the unveiling picture we met with Tesla and at this time we do not see a fit with their product in our fleet, Dave Bates, senior vice president of operations, said in an email, without elaborating. Earlier this week Musk tweeted that the truck would blow your mind clear out of your skull, joking, it can transform into a robot, fight aliens and then make one hell of a latte. Tesla faces a much more crowded field for electric trucks than it did when it introduced its electric cars.
Manufacturers such as Daimler AG, Navistar International Corp and Volkswagen AG are joining a host of startups racing to overcome the challenges of substituting batteries for diesel engines as regulators crack down on carbon dioxide and soot pollution. Still, manufacturers are mostly focused on medium GT trucks, not the heavy big rig market Tesla is after. The unveiling event offered the first look at the radical Tesla semi-big rig after its launch was delayed amid efforts to assist Puerto Rico after Hurricane Maria and Model 3 production hell last month. Musk boasted that the truck has better specs than anything that was suggested in the media to data Tesla would need to invest substantially to create a factory for those trucks. The company is currently spending about $1 billion per quarter, largely to set up the Model 3 factory, and is contemplating a factory in China to build cars. Charging and maintaining electric trucks that crisscross the country could be expensive and complex. Tesla said the truck can charge 30 minutes and then travel 400 miles.